The British Prime Minister and the Mayor of London play a spot of tennis with Paralympians. The short match is on the eve of the 2012 Paralympic Games ticket sales opening. British Prime Minister David Cameron teamed up with Paralympian tennis player Josh Seals on Thursday to play against London's Mayor Boris Johnson and John Parfit. The match came when Cameron met athletes and organizers during the Paralympics Day in London's Trafalgar Square. It's a day before tickets for the 2012 Paralympic Games went on sale. Though short in length, the match was a crowd pleaser. While the Paralympians crisscrossed the court, Johnson dealt some heavy smashes to the Prime Minister, winning the game. Johnson was adamant that the Paralympic Games in London would be promoted in conjunction with the summer games in the city. There's going, to, there's going to be two fantastic sporting events in the summer of 2012, two climaxes, and uh, one's the Olympic, and then the next one's the Paralympic Games. It's going to be, it's going to, and I really hope people will sign up tomorrow uh, for those tickets. Among the athletes were multiple medal winner in swimming, Ellie Simmons, looking forward to London 2012, and Ireland's Jason Smythe, the fastest Paralympian who has run the 100 meters in 10.22 seconds. Heinrich Papau of Leverkusen in Germany is another successful athlete, sprinting in a T42 class. Papau was happy to show visiting school children how his prosthetic leg worked and ran a few races with them. You know, in Athens, it was we started in Athens to get professional. In Beijing, was was good, but the people wasn't into the sport. They didn't know what happened on the track. And I think in 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 in, in London, we have the best professional games for us athletes. The Paralympic movement began at the 1948 London Olympics for former servicemen and women with spinal cord injuries. They competed in wheelchair races and archery.